ODOT participated in a career day for 250 high school students who are interested in highway construction. The event was organized by OKC Public Schools. Oftentimes, students associate highway construction with manual labor and low-paying jobs. But there is a huge need for educated employees to grow in this field. And this career day showed them some of the options that are available to them. ODOT recently participated in a career day for Oklahoma City High School students. The career day was held at OSU OKC and focused exclusively on construction-related businesses and industries. Industries that don't necessarily require a four-year degree, but that need young people out of high school and ready to work and excel. There's absolutely a skills gap uh, in the United States right now. We have a lot of jobs that are unfilled, blue-collar jobs as we call them. And I think what students don't always understand is that you make sometimes a lot more money in a construction trade than you would after going to college for four years and sitting in an office. These guys make a lot of money that, that a lot of people don't know anything about. And the opportunity to get into this field is, is relatively short compared to if you went to, to an OSU or an OU to get a four-year, five-year degree in engineering or something like that. Uh, whereas you can come out of high school and, uh, and within about two years being working full-time on these companies making a good salary. So uh, this is a great opportunity. Not everybody's cut out for maybe college, but everybody can come out here and find something they can do in this field. And there's actually a waiting list to come to this event. Only 250 students are able to participate. We pull from the courses that are geared toward this. It's our construction trade programs, our engineering, welding mechanical trades, um, and agricultural mechanics programs that are allowed to bring students. It's amazing. You get to get in trucks, honk a lot of horns, uh, find out about everything you uh, see here. You learn how they made the roads, that, how they test them, and you get to do a lot of cool things out here. We bring in equipment and simulators and hands-on and people that show the high end of that career industry. Uh, there's a huge need for educated people to take that career, and so we're showing uh, high school students what that education can mean and what it can lead to. So why not show students a brochure or bring a speaker into the classroom? Well, we are talking about teenagers, so they don't learn the same way that adults do. It's easy for us to learn things from a book, but sometimes teenagers need to have fun. They need to see the fun aspect. They need to ask questions. How much money are you going to make? What do you get to do? What do I have to do? They like to, to be hands-on, and it's creative learning. Well, it would be a lot easier to hand them a videotape and show them pictures in a classroom, but I think it's a lot more effective when they get out and get in the seat and maybe get a little bit dirty and dusty and, and get a chance to operate the equipment and see what it feels like. And they're a little more engaged that way. So it's a, it's a lot better experience for them, I think.